Yo, what's going on ladies and gents? My name is Arbuckle, welcome back to another video. Today we are once again back on State of Decay 2, and I wanted to share with you guys how to find every piece of clothing with the new outfit customization update in State of Decay 2. I know a lot of people are on that grind trying to get literally every different outfit that you can possibly get. And, uh, and there's a few things that were mentioned in Undead's, in Undead Labs live stream yesterday that kind of made me want to make this video to, to inform some of you guys on where you can find this stuff and why you might not be finding some of this stuff. So the first thing that you need to know and I think is, is number one priority is uh, that you're not going to get every single outfit in a single map. So let's say you start a brand new community, you play on whatever county you want to play on, whether it's Cascade Hills, Drucker County, you pick a county. You play on it, you haven't looted a single thing, it doesn't matter, you're not going to find everything on one map. You have to play through multiple maps to be able to get every piece of clothing. So if there's something that you're not getting and, and you've searched your entire map, you need to play a different map. So that is number one. Make sure that you are playing all three maps. Unfortunately, you're not going to be able to get everything in one map. They've spread them out so that you have to play all three. So make sure that you're playing different maps. The second thing is if you're in a game and you've already searched, let's say for example there's a specific uh, military hat that you want and the only location is at military outposts uh, in containers. Now if you've already searched all your military outposts, you're not going to get that hat in that map that you're already in. doesn't matter if there's a million other places to search, houses, uh, food marts, you know, gas stations, whatever it may be, if you've already searched all of the containers in military outposts, then you're not going to find that hat. And I'm just using that as an example um, if that's what you're going for. So if you've already searched certain areas, so a lot of these things are found in dresser drawers inside random houses. That's where most of this stuff can be found. If you've already searched through most of your houses, there's a good chance that you're not going to find that much stuff in your map because there, obviously there's like a spawn limit. They're in different places. And, uh, and yeah, so I would recommend when trying to get all of this, this clothing is to play on different maps, start completely different communities and, uh, and just start looting away. Get yourself a car with a lot of gas and just roll through the entire map and, and search. I know some of you guys are on some crazy grinds right now trying to get all the different outfits in the game. Uh, again, I want to remind you guys that if you log in on October 25th, it's very important you log in during the week of October 25th through the 31st so you guys can get a really cool, supposedly the best outfit that's in the game not quite in the game yet but all you have to do is log into state of decay log a community log into a community and uh, and it'll be in your closet so again october 25th through the 31st make sure that you're doing that uh, but yeah these are the two things that i wanted to make this video on to make it clear so that you guys do understand that you're not going to get everything in the world that you're in that you are going to have to play on multiple different maps to be able to get everything and that if you've already searched a significant amount of uh, area or, or locations in your community then you should probably just move on to another world that's that's a fresh start and uh, and go from there if that's what you're trying to do if you're trying to collect literally everything um, but obviously you know you guys beat the game you, you take your community you move somewhere else it's really not that big of a deal you don't um, and, and you get like a max of three different communities so uh, you might as well just do it anyways and uh, and see if you can collect them all. But if you guys have any questions about this, make sure to leave it down in the comment section below. Uh, again, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I'll see all you guys in the next video.